Hey everybody, KC here. So there was a story in the New York Times the other day that uh, just totally got my goat. And it's not food industry related, but it is consumer related and I wanted to bring your attention to it. The story was about how people are petitioning the Federal Trade Commission, consumer activists specifically, are petitioning the FTC, asking them to amend current federal rules so that it is absolutely mandatory for funeral homes to put their pricing online. And I gotta be honest with you, I'm totally in favor of amending the rule that way. I think it is absurd that funeral homes are allowed to get away with not putting their pricing online, especially because you know they're getting to people at a time when they're at their most vulnerable and they can absolutely take advantage of them and not giving them the ability to look at pricing online strikes me as ridiculous. Apparently there was one study that said that 20% of funeral homes don't even make their pricing available in a timely fashion, and that is required by federal rule. It's utterly absurd. You know, the average funeral, apparently, according to the New York Times and a study that they cited, basically costs $76, $7,700. That strikes me as being kind of low, probably depends on where you're living. But one study said a funeral and a burial can cost between $5,000 and $125,000. And again, you know there are a lot of people out there who are pushing for that $125,000 option or something a lot more than what is the minimum. Um, California, as it ends up, is the only state in the union that mandates the online posting of funeral home prices. And again, I just think that's crazy. Now listen, I'm sure there are a lot of funeral homes out there that are feeling the pinch, right? They're sitting there, they got a lot of real estate right now. The funeral home industry has got to be in real trouble because... You know, nobody's having funerals that we're, that we're having them before the pandemic. And I'm sure they're feeling the pinch on, in terms of the economics of this thing. And the other thing is, they're probably sitting there going, but everybody, now people I don't want to be cremated. Not as many people want to be buried. Oh my God, that's going to cost, a, cost us a lot of our profits. Well, I'm really sorry. You better figure out a way to get around that. Because A, somebody's going to kind of figure out how to disrupt your business. And B, even though more people are getting cremated than ever before, you're the ones who are going to get burned if you don't start getting transparent with consumers. Yeah, right. The story got my goat. Anyway, that's what's on my mind this morning. And as always, I want to hear what's on your mind.